Hello and welcome to SolidWorks Tutorials. In this video, I will show you how to design a pen holder or a pencil holder using SolidWorks software. In this lesson, we will learn how to use linear pattern and circular patterns in SolidWorks. Let us create a new file. I'm going to press Ctrl plus N and it's going to be part. Click OK. Here we have the design canvas. I'm going to choose top plane for the design. So right click on top plane here and select sketch first I'll draw a circle this circle could be of any radius click on OK I'm gonna change the units the units are going to be in MMGS go to sketch select smart dimension and select the sketch I'm gonna give dimensions to this circle here and it's gonna be 60 mm click OK now go to features tab and select extruded boss or base under distance give the value as 120 mm so this is the depth or height of the extrusion select OK now we have a solid cylinder here I'm gonna add shell feature to this select shell under features tab and select the top surface and under distance change the value to 2 mm select show preview and click on ok now we added shell feature to this solid cylinder I'm gonna add fillets to this solid cylinder click on fillet and it's going to be constant size fillet select this edge select this edge select the inner part this edge and select the outer edge on the bottom of the cylinder select this outer edge and the fillet radius is going to be 0 0.5 mm click on ok now we also added fillets to this solid cylinder now I want to add some slots or holes on this surface and uh, spread them across the cylinder. So what I'm going to do is, first I'll draw the slot on this surface. To do that, first we need to add a reference plane. Select reference plane and first reference is going to be front plane and second reference is going to be this face and click on ok now we have a reference plane on this surface so right click on this plane and uh, select sketch also we need to have this normal to us so right click on this and click on normal to now we have this normal to under sketch select a corner rectangle but before that let us draw a center line on this surface so I'm gonna draw a center line press escape so we have a center line here and with this line as reference we are going to draw this slots or holes I'm going to draw a random rectangle. The midpoint of this line and the center line should be coincidental. So I'm going to add a relation saying that they are coincidental to each other. Select OK. Now I'm going to add dimensions to this rectangle here. Select Smart Dimension and um, enter the value as 10. And this value is going to be 5. click OK now I'm going to use linear sketch pattern to pattern this on the center line so select linear sketch pattern here and select all the lines and over here click on this dot and change the direction now here the number of instances are going to be let's say six
and the distance between each rectangle is about 15 mm click ok now I'm going to add the distance between the rectangle and this edge click on smart dimension select this edge and select this edge and this is going to be 10 mm click ok the sketch is still under defined so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna add dimension here so select this edge and select this edge and leave it as it is click OK so now the sketch is fully defined what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use extruded cut feature here select extruded cut and under end condition select up to surface now we need to select the surface this is the surface so select this surface and uh, click OK now we have holes now we have all the slots here I'm going to use circular pattern to spread them across this cylinder before that we will display the axis click on this option here and display the axis so we have an axis here go under features tab select this drop down below linear pattern and select circular pattern here so here we need to select pattern axis and this is going to be the pattern axis and all the slots are already selected what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change this and make it 8 the number of instances is going to be 8 so click OK also we will hide all the axes and planes so I'm gonna hide the axis and planes now now we have a pen holder design here or a pencil holder we, we can add some extra material here what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select normal to here and draw a circle select sketch and draw a circle with this as center and for smart dimension select smart dimension and change this to 80 click OK and go to features tab select extruded boss or base and this is going to be 10 mm now I'm gonna add some fillets to this select this face and change the radius to 5 mm click on ok I'm gonna go to appearance and under appearance I select plastic high gloss and I'm going to add some color to this uh, let's add blue select body and you can save the file and this is how you can use patterns and you can design a pen holder or anything which is similar to this also this way you can make holes or any kind of slots on curved surfaces thanks for watching the video stay tuned to the channel for more solidworks tutorials Take care. Bye-bye.